sequence A1, A2, A3 is defined by A1 equals to K and An plus 1 is equal to 2An minus 7 where N is greater than or equal to 1 and K is a constant. We need to write down an expression for A2 in terms of K. So using the rule here to get A2, I would do 2 times A1 minus 7. And I know that A1 is K, so I can replace A1 with K. And so this is my expression for A2 in terms of K, 2K minus 7. Part B, we need to show that A3 is equal to 4k minus 21. So again, using the rule that we're given, I could say that a3 is equal to 2 times a2 minus 1, uh, minus 7, sorry. <clears throat> and in the previous part of the question, we showed that a2 was 2k minus 7. So, 2, lots of 2k is 4k, the 2 lots of the minus 7 is minus 14, minus the 7, so we get 4k minus 21, that is a 3. And then we are told that the sum from 1 to 4 of ar is equal to 43. So what this means is we're first going to substitute 1 into a r, so that's a1. Then we're going to substitute 2 in, so a2. Then we're going to substitute 3 in, a3. And then finally, the last number will be a4. And then we're going to add those together. And we're told that equals to 43. Now, A1 was K, A2 was 2K minus 7, A3 was 4K minus 21. I've not worked out what A4 is yet, but I can work that out now, because I get, again, I can come back to our rule here and say that A4 would be equal to 2 times a3 minus 7. And we know that a3 is the 4k minus 21. So 2 lots of the 4k minus 21 minus 7, which is 8k minus 42 minus 7, which is 8k minus 49. So that's a4. All of that equals 43. So collecting up the k terms here, k, 2k, 4k, 8k, that's going to give me 15k. Oops. Then collecting up the 7, the minus 21, and the minus 49, that gives me minus 77 equals 43. Add the 77 to both sides, so I get 15k is equal to 120, so k is equal to 120 divided by 15, which is 8.